Ciara Speller. I'm Don Shipman. Tonight, discussions continued on the creation of a new joint elementary school in Springfield. The school would be built in Springfield's Mason Square neighborhood, and 22 News reporter Sydney Snow joins us live from Springfield to explain how this potential fusion would impact area residents. This was the third time the community met on this topic of possibly combining Homer Street into Berry schools. If it passes, Mason Square Elementary School students would get a brand new school, something that residents say is desperately needed. Springfield is moving in the right direction and we're showing it by the investment in our young people and the investment in our kids. Homer Street Elementary School opened more than 100 years ago in 1898. DeBerry Elementary School opened in 1951, making these schools some of the oldest in Springfield. In the proposed plan, a multi-million dollar school will be built where the DeBerry School is now. Homer and DeBerry will remain separate schools but share a building, an idea that the school committee members say is a cost-effective and a great opportunity for elementary students. Because they need it. As he said, this one was built in 1898, so they really need an updated school. It's going to be two in one separate entrance, so it's going to be a great opportunity for us students. Among those in attendance of the meeting are many parents who are pushing for the project. Being able to have schools where we can add technology and a lot of the things that are trending that are necessary for our kids to be successful means a lot to them, especially to us as parents to see that the schools are, are being invested in and that our city is really invested in our children. In addition to the new school, there would also be a brand new park built that would replace the current DeBerry Park. It would feature a splash pad and all new lighting. If the proposal passes, the new joint school is expected to be completed in 2023. Live in Springfield, Sydney Snow, 22 News.